Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. This is Aditi and today I am here with a new pattern which looks like this, which is very beautiful. And you can use this pattern in making your cardigans, in making your baby blankets, etc. So to start with, I am taking this my leftover yarn and I will use a hook size of 4.0 mm to make my project. So first of all, we will make a slip knot. And we will start with making our foundation chain. So to make the foundation chain, we will make multiple of four, any number of chains, but it should be a multiple of four. So make multiple of four. So make the chains of multiple of four of whatever length you want make the multiple of four so no now i am done with making my foundation chain and i am having 36 chains for my sample piece now for root one we will skip the first this one we will skip and from the second one we will start making single crochets so start making uh, skip one and start making single crochet from the second chain so single crochet in each and every stitch throughout the chain so complete your row number one by doing single crochet in all the chains and complete your second row now as you can see i have done with my row one now we will start with row two so to start with row two make a chain one and turn your work then again in this row we will single crochet in each and every row and don't forget to make a single crochet in the very first so we will make single crochet throughout the row so complete your row number two by making single crochets and i will show you after that now i am almost done with my second row that is single crochet in all the stitches so i'm now at the last stitch i will make a single crochet in this also then to start for row 3 chain 1 and turn our work and this is the row where we will make the pattern so now we will make three single crochet in the first three stitches starting from the very first i will make a single crochet here then in the next one again a single crochet and in the next one again a single crochet now in the next one as you can see we are having this stitch so we will go at the bottom of this stitch at this point and we will make a double crochet here so making a double crochet now again we will make three single crochets in the next three one two and three now in this one we will go at the bottom of this stitch as you can see this one we will go at the bottom here and we will make a double crochet here like this so our pattern will look something like this now again make three single crochets one two and three now again at the bottom we will make double crochet so this is my next stitch this one and i will go here at the bottom and i will make this is the next one and at the bottom at this point i will make a double crochet so this is my double crochet then in the next three again make three single crochets one two and 
three three single crochets and in the next one i am having this go at the bottom and i will make a double crochet like this so this is my double crochet now again in the next three make three single crochets so one two and three three single crochets and in the next one in this one go at the bottom at this point and make a double crochet i will make a double crochet in the next three again make three single crochets one two and three and in the next one make a double crochet so you have to complete your this row like this only three single crochets and in the next one make a double crochet at the bottom so my pattern will look something like this so i will complete my this row and i will meet you at the end of this row now as you can see i am at the last so now i am done with three single crochets and for at the bottom so i will make a double crochet like this and then i am left with three more stitches so i will make three single crochets one two and this is last one this is three now to start with my next row i will chain one and turn my work so chain one and turn my work and i will single crochet in each and every stitch and don't forget to single crochet in the very first so i will single crochet in the all the stitches now i am about to complete my row four so i have made single crochet throughout my stitches now to start with the next row chain one and turn the work now i am at row number five so to start with row number five make a single crochet in the very first one and now after making one single crochet i will make double crochet at the bottom so i will make a double crochet at the bottom at this point and sorry at this point so i will make a double crochet then again make three single crochets one two and three now for the next stitch this one at the bottom of this i will make a double crochet so here i will make a double crochet again and then i will make three single crochets in the next three stitches so one two and three again in the next one at the bottom of this stitch at this point make a double crochet so this is a repetition of two rows only and only four stitches again make three single crochets one two and three and in the next one make a double crochet at the bottom of the next stitch. this is my next stitch at the bottom here i will make a double crochet so i will repeat this only for my further row now i am at the end of this row and i am left with two stitches i have done three single crochets now in the next one i will make a double crochet here and now i am left with only one stitch so i will make a single crochet here in the last stitch so here it is a single crochet now to start with the next row i will make a chain one and turn my work and for the row number six i will single crochet in each and every stitch so make single crochet in all the stitches from the previous row so row number six is single crochet in all the stitches so complete your row number six and i will meet you after as you can see i am done with my row number six so to start with my row number seven i will chain one and it is the repeat of this row row number two so to start with i will make single crochet in the next three stitches so make single crochet in next three stitches and 
in the next one at the bottom make a double crochet so this is my next stitch at the bottom of this i will make a double crochet like this again in the next three it is three single crochets one two and three and in the next one i will make a double crochet at the bottom of my next stitch so here i will make a double crochet again in the next one make three one two and three so you will complete your this row also like this only to complete your this row i will meet you after now i am at the last of this row so i will make a three single crochet in the next three one two and three so this is a very simple pattern which you can use in your blankets also and you can use in your cardigans or baby sets also so this is a simple repeat of two rows one is the single stitch row and next is the three single crochets and one double crochet at the bottom three single crochet one double crochet at the bottom and in the next row what you will do is single crochet in the first one double crochet at the bottom three single crochets one double crochet at the bottom three single crochet one at the bottom the only difference in the rows are in the first one i have made firstly three single crochets and then a double crochet and in the next one i have made one single crochet and one double crochet in the next one then starting with three single crochet double crochet three single crochet double crochet so this is how the pattern look likes you can use this in your blankets also and in your cardigans also so please subscribe to my channel if you like my videos and don't forget to give a thumbs up to my video thank you